guys, welcome back to the Dragonfield Book 3 Let's Play. We've got a new chapter in the story today. I clicked on um, Book 3 Dragonfield and it ported me right here. So I'm assuming this is where I need to be. So we have a quest tab. In search of Slayers. I think that's the name of the quest, I can't remember. Just gone. No, okay. Uh, okay, uh, in search of Slayers then. Why have I got the Mogloween background? Wait, is that supposed to be there? Never mind. I'm an idiot. I thought it was like a Mogloween event or something. Guess not. I'm a dickhead. Captain Lestrade. Okay. The scouts have reported a dense nest of fungal growth covering the city. We'll need... Lestrade, you promised to listen to the speaker. And here he is. But here you are, taking their charge like nothing happened. Mertha. The Great One ordered the Dragolos to aid the Dragagringad Alliance in retaking Dragzwad. Naturally, as the greater force, the Dragolods will lead the charge. As And as a captain of the Dragolods, I am therefore commanded position. Is that going to be a problem? I asked you a question. Is my command going to be a problem? Nope. Good to hear, as I was saying. The fungal growth has covered the city. We can try to banish the way with dragon fire, but such magic asks a lot of our partners. Uh, as such, I propose we enter the city and search for that any information that may allow us to reclaim the city from the inside. It probably wouldn't be a good idea to get dragons out anyway. Think about it, Dragsvad is a place for dragon slayers. So you've been loads of dragons in there, it might not be that good. But then again, all the dragon slayers are probably dead. Or preoccupied. Um, If I may, I don't think that it will be so. You're from the Rose, right? We definitely don't need advice from the likes of you. So yourself. If there aren't any more interruptions, let's get this ex execution. <laughs> Expedition started. Drag guards to the front. We'll be taking the main streets along with our guides. Meanwhile, you alliance folk will seek out whatever remains of the dragon slayers. See if we can get some allies with a better understanding of the situation. Meanwhile, we'll have the dragons burning away at the top in shifts. We cannot allow this to spread any further. Move out, yay. Why is Draco like always messing around in the background? <laughs> uh, Hansa, you had a concern? It's probably nothing. Are you sure? If there's anything bothering you, we should be aware of it. Your insight is always valuable. Despite everything as my world comes crashing down around me, I fall back on spite, on familiar, thorny conflict. You have only been welcoming. I should not hold you account for Lestrade's words. Sir, what did you want to say? Did you send something? The fungus, it goes deep. Deeper than I can see. Under the water and further below. Whatever it is, it's alien to me. I cannot determine its nature. But I do know we're only literally scratching the surface. So we should be prepared for anything. You don't happen to have any more containment suits lying around, do you? No, we do not. But inhaling the spells of whatever this is it cannot be healthy. We thought to bring it up with the Dragon Lord, Captain, but he appears to be resilient to suggestions. Resistant, or whatever it said. I haven't heard of any adverse effects from the Dragon Slayers, though. Although, I haven't heard from the Dragon Slayers in quite some time either. While I understand the Magister may have rather unflattering views on the lands outside of their borders, I think our policy of not ingesting foreign material into our bodies may have proved wise in this case. There may be a long term effect that are not an immediate event. You may begin to sprout mushrooms one day, so I am suddenly find yourself unable to breathe. Or lose bodily functions years afterwards. Or... I think I get the point, Nostromir. I think... 
I can provide a solution with wind magic. But I'll need to focus and it will be quite draining. That's only a temporary solution, then. We'll need to find something permanent while we can. Well, Sava and I are not fighters. We can work on some sort of protective headgear for you while we proceed with our task. Thank you. Let's go then. Yarnoth, do you know how where the Dragon Slayers were holding out? A lot of the tri a lot changed since last I visited, but I think I can find the way. Awesome. Oh, this place is real cool. Is that a person? No. <laughs> Does it look like a person? I do not think so. Yeah, this guy survived. Wait, oh yeah, I was just to. Yeah, shit. I forgot about that. He furious. Why did I do that? A little bit of a kill. Well, element is my dragon. Okay. I didn't actually realize when I was getting it. Um, well, they we to fire then? Might as well get fire. Um, I have my. Yeah, let's put on third car. I don't know if fire is their main weakness. Let's have a look. Um, hollow human. Uh, yes, it is by minus ten. Okay, look at this egg of the ice scythe. The ice scythe. I don't know why I can't speak when I'm recording. I'm not gonna take it off because I can't be bothered and there's not really much point. Unless we get a really powerful boss like soon. Um attack. Nice. Okay, um Which way should let's go this way. Okay, so what am I doing? I'm just trying to make my way somewhere. Or am I trying to find any People who have survived the attacks. Uh, stun offers. Let's stun. The stun is always a bit weak. Oh, wait, these are resistant. Okay, um. Oh, uh, immobility 100. Okay. That makes sense. 100. Perfect immobility. Okay, nice. Uh, can I go inside here now? They're so quiet. It probably means they're dead. Don't know about you. That's the way I feel. Probably means they're dead. Okay, so, um... I'm not reading the text at the top too much. I probably should, but I don't like reading. Funnily enough, so... Yeah. And it doesn't really give me much time to read it. So, I, and... Oh... Uh, unsettling even for me. What do you mean even for me? <laughs> You're the most cowardly person in this group. By far. <laughs> Trying to like big himself up and like, make him sound like he's tough. You're not tough, Fostermere. You are the complete opposite. I knew this, Forge. Oh no, Paul Galnor. Um, I'm gonna get a Scython. Because fuck you, why not? Might as well give it health back. Are you trying to like fold a mushroom? Oh. Okay. Um, Australia looks like you're insane. Tara his head disapprovingly. We are fully healed for now. <laughs> oh, it's the it's a big loop. Okay, so I just ate around the mushroom. I don't know why you would do that. But you know, the game let me. So I'm obviously going to do it if I have the choice. Uh, headquarters were this way, the fungus. Okay. So I'm guessing these people are like either civilians or dragon lords. Kind of grim when you think about it, but you know. Rest in peace. Now what you can do about now, you are dead. Well, you might not be dead. You might be like, um, you know, usually in like shows like, I don't know, Walking Dead, you get like, 
when you die, you come back. But these people might not actually be dead. They might be like living while being controlled. It's where that one looks like a dragon slayer. Okay, so it is a dragon slayer. Okay. Well, by definition, definition, you should be incredibly weak because you're a dragon slayer. But I probably stand corrected. Maybe. Well, I almost one shot your ass. Um, stun. Wait, can I even stun? Yes, I can. Okay. Okay, you went much of a trouble. I will take that back. I mean, I will not take that back. That reinforced my statement. That dragon stays our shit. Okay. I had my suspicions. But that, that was a dragon slayer. Hmm. This is awful. These first people inhaled the spores and were turned into these. It's a terrifying possibility. Right, everyone. Yes, I thought I had something. Seems this base isn't entirely abandoned. Open up, it's Galnoth. I'm with allies. Can it be? Galnoth? Uh, no, it must be a hallucination. Or maybe the Hollow Ones have learned to mimic voices. But if it's Galnoth, then we could be saved. If you open that door, you'll doom us all. Don't, stop being foolish. If you don't open the door, I'm breaking it down. Yeah, that's Galnoth. <laughs> is, it, is it safe? Nope, still mushrooms. I'm going back. We're here to help and to get you our drag vad if needed. Unless you can fight. What can you tell us about what happened? Well, after the eruption, uh, we did what we could to get people to safety. But we're, well, dragon slayers, not mushroom slayers. We did our best, but more and more of the hollow creatures kept coming. I'm sorry, the hollow creatures? The, uh... Things you fought and saw all over the city, they're not people, they're, well, hollow. As far as I can tell, the fungus just kind of produces them, not sure from where. They're so weird, sometimes we'll watch them almost, almost be human. They'll aimlessly go in and out of buildings, or what remains of them. But they don't do anything until they come across something living. Uh, not hollow, I mean. Perhaps an effect on these spars. Are there any other survivors? If it's the spars, they haven't had any effect on us, I don't think. There are definitely other people out there too. We tried to help, we really have. But it's an ex um, extremely hostile environment. I see. I we'll have to make it a priority to save civilians we come across. What's your name? Oh. Uh, I'm sorry, my name is Cord, and you are La. Brief introduction later. I see. So I used to reclaim Dragvad and hopefully stop the spread of the fungus. But if refugees have already made it to the mainland, then surely the spores. It's only a matter of time before it starts there. The great one is using their power to cleanse dragon's grasp and the surrounding areas. As a nature dragon, the great one does not hold somewhere some sway over such elements, but that is still a relatively small selection of Gringard. That's, but after doing all we can, the destruction here cannot be allowed to visit the main continent. God, are you and your fellow dragon slaves willing to help us? We'll have to find out where these hollows are coming from. And then how we can stop this fungus. We could certainly use your help. Of course, of course. We drink slaves will always rise to the occasion. Just as Galnoth has. And now that reinforcements have arrived. I'm sure we'll be able to manage. Good to hear. Midnight. If you don't mind, I'd like to speak to the dragon slaves privately. We'll just have to wait here then. Thank you. I skipped Draco one. 
Thank you, little one. And what if Midnight needs me to grow? Yes, I think it is perfect. <laughs> well, I've completed the protective gear for everyone else as well. Well, we have managed so far thanks to Kara's magic. If you are to enter the spa's dense areas, we better be safe, if you ask me. Thank you, Velsfava. Austrian. I could do with the break. Ah, is your private business concluded then? It is. Those dragon slayers and fighting shape will join our cars. You others will be evacuated to Dragon's Grass when possible. But I am so concerned about the origin of the hollow. We have completed our current assigned task. Let us go path and regroup with the Dragon Lords. I imagine our information will be of great use to them. And I am eager to learn what they have to have discovered as well. Okay. Loot for the kids. Oh, I get a helmet. Hmm. I mean, they look pretty weird. But I don't really care about them right now, so... No, thank you. If they had better stats, then maybe. But they all have kind of random stats. Kind of average... That. Okay, so we're done. Uh, quest, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this on here then. Okay, thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.